Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back. John Megacycle here and more Factorio Bob's Mod Flavor. I don't know what that was either. Let's just move on. <laughs> Never speak of it again. I uh, hope you're doing well. I'm doing quite fine myself. No complaints here. Um, let's see, we can request your chest. Uh, anyway, for this episode, uh, we're doing a lot of request your chest, push pull, trying to get a lot of these resources moved around. Um, I'm going to extend our logistics network, and I want to gut and redo this blue nonsense completely. This part of the line is fine. I don't think I want to touch this for the inserter piece, but this uh, board stuff takes forever. These things take, like, was it 10 or 12? Uh, 5, which is way longer than these inserters, which take 0.5. So if you come down the math, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, 0 0.5, that's 2, and we can produce one of these. Uh, the thing is, these take five, but all these other processes take a lot as well. This takes five, I think this takes two or something, 0.5. So we can easily stretch this out, really make this a lot more robust. The research, once we have it dialed in, I'm going to be less inclined to gut it and move it. Uh, logistics speed level five, am I ready for that? That's going to suck up a lot of my research for a long time. Let's go logistics three. What is this? Advanced research. Ooh. Yeah, yep, logistics, thanks. Um, the other thing is these boards are used for so many other pieces of technology and things I want to make more of, especially considering the RoboPort. That takes 45 of these, what are these, basic electronic circuits? Basic electronic circuit boards. So the thing is that takes an obscene amount of time and energy and resources. These speed, ins or the smart inserters, I only need them for this. I'm not branching that off and using them anywhere else, but these electronic boards, I need them for tons of other stuff. Uh, I need 10 more. One, two. <laughs> I really wish I could craft this crap by hand. Three, four. <laughs> I also need new chests. Five, six, let's do one, two, three, four. Ugh, that was fast, awesome. Uh, sniper turrets two. Uh, what is this, what's next? Sniper turrets three. Holy crap. 3,400% damage bonus. Woof. That's all I'm gonna say about that. NVGs, personal laser defense two. A bunch of other crap. Let's get these mines taken care of. Mines are a lot of fun if you have them as blueprints. They could be a lot of fun as blueprints. And what I mean by that is you can lay down a very robust defensive strategy with mines, setting them down and just leaving them as is. And when they explode, um, the shell will be there, that blueprint shell that you're used to. So what'll happen is the bots will come and replace them anyway. So that makes it even better. Yeah, this will extend our logistics network a bunch. Then I can actually continue on and build up more stuff. And then we can just go from there. Thank you. How far can I take this? Perfect. <clears throat> Good. Um, oh, look, for the first time, we actually have available logistics robots. That's awesome. That actually makes me feel really much better about the situation. Now, I need assembling machines. I'm going to need way more than that. Let's do four more. Uh, how much blue do we have left? Not a ton. So we'll do one or two more red-green researches, and then we'll go from there. So, transistors. So let, let's take this from the top. We need what? Synthetic wood and resin, right? That makes these, that makes a bunch. Let's get two of those going on. So I need a requester chest. And we're gonna do it this way. There's one. There's one or two. <laughs> uh, gimme, please paste. And 
Yeah, let's get this other mine out. I like doing the research that requires, or that doesn't add to more stuff, and that might sound weird. Uh, did that work? That totally worked. Good. There's our power. Here's our output. There's our new line, and I think it'll be saturated. I don't know. We'll have to find out. Okay, I'll have to boogie down there eventually. Lights for the love of God. <laughs> yes, thank you. Um, oh, actually, before we get very much farther, power. Yep, that saturates it very nicely. Let's let's take a pause. Let's take a break. I need power. Large solars. Okay, just a different front. <laughs> 14 turrets are engaged with the enemy. Yeah. Uh, steel. Copper. Basic electronics. Uh, I don't think the copper line runs down here, does it? Uh, here's what we're going to do. Steel and basic will be easy enough, I think. Uh, let's go large, large solar panels as is. And I need a fast inserter, fast long arm. Might as well get the best, right? There's our steel. Um, take that back. I need one of these. So here's how this is going to work. Regular. Fast. Or long arm. That takes care of that. Now all it needs is copper. Which I almost don't mind filling myself. I guess. How much copper do I have on hand? Not a ton. <clears throat> That's okay. I'm afraid this process could go very rogue very fast. Oop, okay, that was easy. Uh, so red-green. That's what I wanted to aim at. Anything... Anything decent in the red-green territory? Yep, perfect. Tank cannon, whatever damage. Do it. Our iron should be... Huh, iron's really not keeping up anymore. Not there nor down here. Okay, we're defeating the process of a buffer if it's not even making it to the factory. There we go, that's better. Okay, so copper was next. Uh, is it easy for me to pull some copper? Uh, yeah, we kind of did this a little dumb though. <laughs> I did this a lot of dumb. And now I'm paying the price. I guess... For sake of stupid, I guess I'm just gonna throw a requester chest down and call it a day. Uh, no. I still take that back. I'll just do it manually. Steal all of this. And then we're gonna go and pilfer all the machines. There we go. And, just to make this even easier... There. That's a good amount of solars. And it's not wasted production regardless, because these can turn into the other solars as well. Yep, it just takes an ungodly amount of time, which is fine. Uh, next up is substations. That's the next thing I want to really look into. And substations required five of the... Of the uh, Rama Jum Jum electronic circuit board, right? You lose a lot of space with power poles and such, so I was really hoping one or two substations. I don't know why I have this guy on me, but go away. I'm really hoping a couple of substations will help. Uh, oh, I'm just out of copper now. Okay, well I'll take I'll take enough for two, so I need two more. And then we also have to work on accumulators. Uh, let's grab some copper for ourselves, and then we'll take a look into that. 
Um, actually, that can get out. I'll take another stack of that. Uh, we have Logistics 3 now as well, so we could actually start talking about the even faster belts. Uh, what was I just doing? Oh yeah, two substations. Now, accumulators are next. Let's take a gander at what this all is. We have basic accumulators, 300,000, oh, five megajoules. That's pretty much what we're used to. Simple to make. We have plenty of batteries, no big deal on that. This is a fast accumulator, which has slower input, better output. High capacity accumulator, which is 10 megajoules. Okay, it's it's a double. It's a double accumulator based on everything. Resources, capacity, input output, and a slow accumulator which has better input, but I don't really understand the point of all that. I think I just want to go high capacity accumulators. This is something we could easily set up. It requires iron and batteries. We should have plenty of batteries. I think the last time I checked we had several stacks. We have 642. Okay, good. Iron is back to where it should be. I'm happy with that. Let's go ahead and take a look at our battery haul. Um, I don't need these batteries. I think I was hanging on to them when I was making bots by hand. That sounds like a company name. <laughs> bots by hand. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Nope. Nope. That's not what I wanted. Batteries and iron. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. High capacity accumulator seems like exactly what I want. And I think I want to spoon feed the iron. I guess I'm just a little. No, you know what? Forget that. You. Iron. Is around here somewhere. There we go. 200 sounds great. And these take how long to make? 10? Alright, I need to be careful because of batteries. Whoa! Good boys. Jeez. I'm assuming this is really running at pretty full capacity. How much sulfur do I have? Plenty sulfuric acid. Let's get another chem plant going on. Let's get this, uh, let's get this moving a bit. I'm going to remove that from there. I'm going to put it there instead. Remove. Place. Give me a little bit of room here, because I want this to share the same... How do I want to do that? I want it to share the same input chest. I'm going to lose a chest either way, but there's that. There's that. Very good. And now we need a place for output. I guess another passive provider, right? I'm going to lose a chest either way. I'm trying to really make this a little more tight and efficient, but I don't think that's going to happen. Um, so at least we have now, we have a stockpile of batteries that are isolated from the actual accumulator stack. How many accumulators have we got? Six? Awesome. That's a good start. Um, how's our power? I'm sure adding more factories does not help. Hello? There we go. Hmm. I wonder why we were spiking a bit ago. Weird. Um, either way. Uh, let's go check on our solars. This is going to be an excellent project to get done. So we'll add some solar power. Might do another boiler steam engine assembly. I don't really know yet. Um, okay. I don't know why I blanked out for a second there, but that's okay. Uh, what are these? Good. Plenty of turrets on hand. How's this going? That's going fine. 17 solar panels. That's great. So what's a nice area that has little to no resources I can actually get started? I still want to save this for my ultimate oil. So we'll do that. I think we can push this more to the left. 
Um, let's see. I do want another RoboPort or two to get over there. Realistically, later on, when we have a logistics network that's pretty stacked up, um, this won't be an issue at all. What's the matter with the inserters? What's the matter with this? Iron gear. Oh, we're out of iron. Okay, well, it's kicking back up now, so... There, just to make it... To make everything square. There. Catch up a little, alright? <laughs> You're embarrassing me. Let's take a look at... Uh... No, we don't, we don't have enough of any of that. <clears throat> so anyway, I'm just going to place these myself, and then we'll just worry about whatever later. We have some good room, I hope, somewhere. Kinda not really. Yeah, kinda not really. Um, actually, let's do this in the south. I don't really foresee me doing anything... Oh, cool. There's another red-green tech out of the way. Um... What else... What else am I really hurting for? Like, what else was the next thing I really wanted? Uh, integrated electronic... Oh, God, that's a whole nother kettle of fish I'm not ready for. Not ready for any of that. <laughs> Combat robot damage. That's cute. Uh, we've got a lot of the laser tech fit, uh, ready to go as well. Um, what is this? Chemical processing. Electric chemical furnace, chemical plant to... Uh, rocketry? Let's do rocketry. That sounds like fun. And this copper line is running low on copper. Oh, mainly because we were... I stole a bunch. Um, are all the things even working? Not all the things are even working. Do I have drills? I do. There we go. That's handled. Oh uh, yeah, I'm gonna do this in the south. So, accumulators. Thank you. I'm gonna grab a few more solars before we actually get started. How many uh, of our logistics bots are doing nothing? Wow, a lot of them are doing nothing. That's great. That means they've all caught up doing whatever they needed to do. So I can put these in requester chests now. And I could just take them logistically. <laughs> I could have the robots just hand that crap to me, which would be great. I'm hoping this will help. Um, if anything, it'll keep us under capacity. Or it'll keep us producing enough. That way... Uh, we're not having brownouts and such. Uh, they're nowhere near, right? Oh, well, kinda. Yeah, let's just do it. I like to keep all the trees I can, but I really need the room for solars. Room for solars, you say? Yes, because that means I have significantly less of a need for steam. And it's the boilers that actually cause the pollution, so let's just... Do this. This does not have to be perfect. Actually, I guarantee you it won't be perfect. Um, I really thought there was way more range on this thing. Guess not. Rocket. That gives us rocket, rocket body, rocket warhead. I wonder if that's used later, if there's a rocket launcher or... If that if that's artillery or something, I don't know what that really is. What is this? Substation Mark II? <clears throat> sure. Have fun. Why not? Alright, now let's fill these in with our... Where'd you go? There you go. And this was the idea in my head. Oh, nope, that didn't quite pan out the way I wanted it to. But I think you get the idea. There we go. There we go. And we're already pretty much out of resources. Uh, let's see, something like that? That maybe? I kind of want this to be linear, 
like copy pasteable. How did I? Okay, so hang on. It was in the middle. So I think right there is what I'm looking for. Um, oh, the problem is they're not connected. Wire reach 14. Okay, how about right there? There we go. I'm out of those. I'm out of accumulators. Okay. Good start. Accumulator capacity. I don't know how the heck it's going up. Oh, oh, I lost stuff. A uh, turret of some sort. Well, the good thing is I have a lot of turrets on hand. It's pitch black. How am I, how are the accumulators gaining capacity? Oh, steam engines, of course. I'll take that, because you're not doing a darn thing. Good enough. I'll take you as well. Oh, nope. 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 I was too early. My bad. My bad. <clears throat> I'm still under the impression that when you have those miners just sitting there, they're still actively drawing power. Even if they're doing nothing. So it's important that we pull that stuff. I need, I need some lights here. This is ridiculous. Oh, come on. I wasn't done with you. Oh, good. <laughs> good amount. Let's build that all up. Okay, let's take a bit of a gander what we got going on over here. Do I have repair kits? I have all the repair kits. Awesome. Lost, uh, level two. Okay, well, guess what? I'm producing, and production is good. Good, good, okay. Um, I'm gonna do one more run, get some more solars online, and that's gonna give us, hopefully, a good baseline as to how much more we need to actually make it worth something. In Vanilla Factorio, you need a lot. You, you, you really need a substantial amount, especially if you ever plan on getting off of your fossil fuels completely. Um, realistically, right now, the plan isn't to get off fossil fuels. The plan is to get something that's substantial enough that can support us as we're growing. <coughs> Excuse me. That way I'm not adding more to my fossil fuel burn, and I can start saving coal. I think we need coal for other stuff later on. Um, coal was used for... Is that a tree? It was a tree. Um, coal is used for some military technology. I, I believe it's uh, hand grenades later on. And by later on, I meant like in vanilla. I don't know what it is in Bob's mod, so I want to make sure we have some of it considering the sun is an infinite resource. The coal that we're pulling out of the ground is a very finite resource. So that's an important distinction. Uh, any other red-green we could do? All this crap, I have no idea. Um, if I transmission? Sure. Why not? Yep, that's gonna be the one problem with these large boys is the range. Okay, so now realistically what we need to figure out is if we could separate the steam from the solar, how long it takes for the accumulators to... Holy crap, 3.3 megawatts? That's substantial. That's very substantial. That won't last us like a full night, but that's, that's awesome. Great. I'm going to work on the basic circuit boards. Basic circuit boards? Electronic boards? Basic... How did I get stuck here? There we go. Um, how are we doing on oil? Oh, still have a bunch stored up. This stuff's firing non-stop. We actually have a surplus of heavy. That's great. And we have all the boards we could ever want. 
It feels so good to get something like that finalized and figured out. Oh, I haven't had to deal with coal in forever. Probably because the uh, the steel hasn't been pulled that much, so it's it hasn't been that much of a requirement. Anyway, uh, back to what I wanted to do five minutes ago. Yeah, our blue is terrible. <clears throat> Time to work on that. And by that, I mean this. So now we have plenty of this stuff. This requires, what, iron, iron, copper, and whatever that is. So I need a few more manufacturing facilities. I need uh, copper, okay? It's going to be a funny conversation considering I think I'm out of copper. No, we've got some down here. Good. Get a bunch of that. Now these take five to make, and these take five to make. So that at least is a one-to-one. -one. So let's just boop, 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 boop. This is just going to be easier for the liquid portion of the game. There's that. There's that. Now, what I want to do is I want one requester chest. Oop, that was fast. Um, take a break for a second. I want one requester chest, and I want it to fill up all these things. So how do we want to do that? How do I want to do that? Um, should I move this up? Yeah, let's, let's move it uh, vertically instead of horizontally. If I'm putting it there just for the sake of the liquid, that's stupid. So I could easily do something like this. I still want my four. Uh, do I still have it in my clipboard? Yes, I do. And we could do something like that. And the requester chest can still go here. And get this out of here. Oh, <laughs> crap. That was fast. Copy paste. Turn it around. Fantastic. Um, I need some smart inserters, believe it or not. Okay, very good. <clears throat> so here's what we're going to do with a single, a single chest. Actually, I'm going to move you up. And we're going to go something like... Requester chest. And copy-paste. Holy crap, that just makes my life so much easier. You are iron. You are copper. And this way, what I can do... Then I can pull this off as far as I want. No problem. I can, This can go on forever, or whatever. But if we need to expand more, that's no issue right there. So there is the mineral portion. Now we need the... Oh, what? Oh, tin. It's, uh, it's not iron at all. It's tin. Okay. Nope, that's aluminum. Try again. <laughs> tin. There we go. Okay. That takes care of that. Now the liquid portion of this experiment. There's that. And I need some underground pipes. Boop, boop. Not too shabby. Cool. That, what, doubled? That doubled our effectiveness of trying to make blue signs. Oh, this is just sucktacular. <laughs> okay, and already I don't like this setup, even though I just set it up. Because now I'm stuck. There we go. Probably won't have to go to that side ever again anyhow. So, we have this, and now they need these things. So we're going to do something like this. There's that. And again, we can just pull this off as far as we need to. No problem. That's why I designed it this way. Uh, ding, ding. In, in. In, in. 
there and then we'll do a different line going like I need that there we go and then I need a different line and we'll go like this and that'll be output uh, let's see here this stuff takes a while so just some regular long arm inserters will be fine keep calling them long arm I don't I mean that's what it is but anyway so yeah, if we want to add two or even four more to this chain, no problem. We wouldn't be disrupting anything at this point. The only thing that's being disrupting is how many of these power poles I'm throwing down. There we go. What are you missing? Oh, for God's sake. Oh, that's okay. No, we're still good. We're still good. <laughs> God, it looked so neat and perfect. I knew something had to be wrong. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Nope. All good. Okay. A bunch of destruction. I'm going to have to look into that. Two, three, four. What did I lose? A couple of turrets. A couple of walls take a damage. All right. We'll, we'll get there. Oh, okay. I'll get there. <laughs> Trust me, buddy. We'll, we'll do it together. Ugh, wait a minute, that's not right either. <laughs> Holy crap. You can tell it's a little late. You've been playing a lot of Factorio, and it's probably time to go to bed when your brain just doesn't want to function no more. Okay, yep, these things take minimal requirements, and it's just going to take a while for it to produce. No big deal. Uh, let's go ahead and... Yeah, let's call it an episode here. I need to run to... Why is this not producing? We're out of boards. Okay, great. Another thing I got to deal with. Oh, probably because we're out of copper. Anyway, I'm going to pause it right here. Thanks for joining me, guys. I need to take a check on the outposts and see what's going on with that. Uh, this has been John Megacycle. Thanks again for joining me, and I'll catch you next time.